A teacher was stabbed in the chest with a screwdriver. He was taken to the hospital and he is said to be in a stable condition. The head of department at the school, Rachel De Dick, told NBC News that the teacher had slapped a learner as a form of discipline yesterday, who then informed his father. She said during the staff members' daily meeting this morning, the grade 9 teacher did not attend. The HOD says the next thing that happened was a learner who barged into the meeting screaming. And then one learner came screaming in the staff room, telling the teachers that uh, one man stepped Mr. Kalola. Then that's where now we ran out of the staff room and see where the commotion was. So when we uh, came there at the, at the commotion, so we saw that Mr. Kalola is, was bleeding. The Dick emphasized on disciplinary policies of the school and procedures that ought to be followed. They must come, there are procedures to follow, disciplinary uh, procedures to follow, so they have to come and see the principal, and the principal have uh, disciplinary procedures to follow. Learners were left severely shocked, and some highlighted the effects of corporal punishment in schools. We have kids that go through different things at home and, and stuff. So like that will al allow the child to reflect on like emotions and stuff because not everyone will want to be corporally punished by a teacher. That will cause them to reflect and cause commotion within the school. We'd initially first go to the office and inform the teacher or my register teacher of what happened, what had happened. And I'll obviously tell my parents. I'm, it's, it's very concerning. You know, because apparently this happens a lot in schools and it's, I think it goes both ways. Uh, I'm not, I think both teachers and uh, the police, because the police said apparently um, the teachers have to know their limits because apparently the teacher slept the child and that is what caused the parent to react like that. The lessons had to continue as learners wished their teacher a speedy recovery.